How's everybody doing today? Getting ready to go pick up Tim and we're going to head out to a guy's creek that's been having a lot of trouble with beaver. Uh, really starting to tear up some larger size trees so we're going to go try to put a stop to that and uh, hopefully catch one of these beavers out working on the dam tonight. So stay tuned. We'll go pick up Tim and head out to the creek and see what's going on. All right guys, me and Tim are out here tonight to try to put a stop to these beavers that are on this guy's property that uh, Tim works with. Gonna walk around here a little bit and just show you some footage of what they've been doing and kind of what our setup looks like. So, uh, Tim, you got anything you wanna add in here? Uh, it's gonna be an interesting night. This is Jeff's property. Uh, he's got a, he's got a, forge across this creek that's his uh, way to and from his house and the beaver are starting to move rocks and you know build up a nice dam right here on the north side of his his forge so we'll try and get these guys out of here so he can get to and from <laughs> this is the entry bridge to this guy's property so these beaver are just taking these chunks of limestone and pushing them up here to start a base and they'll start packing in the branches and logs and sod behind that. So he came out here last night, cleared all this off before he went to bed and then drove to work this morning and all that was laying right there.
good shot. Nice. Way to go, dude. Good shot. <laughs> good shot. Oh, so much blood. This went back in that hole. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, as you can see, <laughs> just had a successful harvest. Yeah, dude. Tim put a good shot on him. I think we got some good video footage yeah. of that. So we're going to try to get over here on the other side of the creek real quick before it gets too dark on us and see if we can recover him. But yeah, uh, good shot by Tim. And Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Wor worked out perfect. First yep. time we looked at this uh, creek and That's a we had a pretty good idea where he might have might be coming from and just probably coming down here to get started on the dam. So yeah, nice head on him. He's a probably big beaver. Hopefully, yeah. we can get him out of there. Yeah, he's a dandy. <laughs>we just want to take a little bit of time here and just kind of give you a backstory on how this hunt unfolded tonight and uh, Tim's got some yeah. information on that yeah we the property owner his name was Jeff and we worked together uh, and he was talking about wanting us to come out there and take care of his, his beaver problem he was more worried about just killing it and not being able to harvest the meat or do anything with it you know get right. the pelts off of it so He's more interested in us going out there for that reason was to be able to harvest it and actually enjoy the meat and enjoy the, the pelt off of it. So we're definitely going to eat the meat tonight because it's, it's cooking yeah. right now. It looks pretty good. Yeah, it's good stuff. We we did this one time last year on Tim's property and yeah. uh, had a clean kill on on his property and brought it back here and cooked it. Yeah. So. so if you've never had beaver meat, you should maybe give it a shot because it's, it's pretty tasty stuff. And it's good stuff. We're going to cook it up and maybe take it to some co-workers and let them try it and see how that goes. Definitely take something back to Jeff so he can, you know, enjoy the spoils of, you know, the animal that was on his property. Right. So just as always, want to say thanks, guys, for following along here. And uh, Tim and I is going to keep getting out in the woods, doing various hunts, hopefully uh, helping some people that we know um, take care of the beaver problems that they have. And... If you guys don't mind, just please hit subscribe, follow along, getting ready to get into turkey season here. So hopefully get some good footage of that for you guys and happy hunting. Be safe. See, See you guys. See ya. It is mighty tasty.